Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel. I'm Ofelia Orate, a principal owner of a school and tutorial center, a math teacher, and an author of 21 books. My most recent books are the following. College Entrance Reviewer Books 1 and 2, Core Concepts Reviewer for any high school, especially Science High School, PSHS Reviewer Volume 3 and 4, you can buy them online at Lazada and Shopee. My channel is about math tutorials which can help you with your entrance exams, SAT, and ordinary math class lessons. Please subscribe and click the bell button. Let's start! Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel, Math with Mrs. O. This is now the continuation of our possible entrance exam questions, part 7. Okay, the question is, two cars are traveling toward each other, one at a speed of 50 kilometers per hour, and the other one at 40 kph. After how long will they meet if they are now 15 kilometers apart? Okay. Normally, you students will come up with a table, B, R, T. Remember, distance is rate times time. Okay. So, part one says that it is traveling at a speed of 50 kph or kilometers per hour. Part two, based from the problem, is traveling at 40 kilometers per hour. After how long? That would be your time here is x. So therefore, you get the distance by applying the rate times time. Rate 50 times time x. So the distance here is 50x. Rate is 40 times time x. So the distance is 40x. Now, let's come up with an equation. It says in the problem that the two cars are traveling toward each other. So if this is car 1, it is going that way. Car 2 is also going that way. So they are traveling toward each other. After x hours, you see that the distance traveled will now be 1. 15 kilometers. Okay? So this whole distance will be 15 kilometers. So now, what is our equation? So the distance traveled by car 1 will be fifty x here, plug it in, plus the distance traveled by car 2 is 40x will now be equal to the total distance traveled, which is given in the problem to be 15 kilometers. There. So now you add this. So you have 90x is equal to 15. Then the usual simpli uh, simplification or Isolating x, the usual you learned in grade 7, divide both sides by 90 so that you can isolate x. So x here is equal to 15 divided by 15 is 1. 90 divided by 15 is 6. So now we have 1 over 6 of an hour. What is 1 over 6 of an hour? In minutes, how do we uh, convert an hour to a minute? So, one sixth hour times one hour is equal to 16 minutes. There, we can now cancel 60 and 6. We are cancelable. 60 divided by 6 is 10. 6 divided by 6 is 1. Take note that the hour also has been cancelled. So 1 times 10 is 10 minutes. So 
the answer is one six of an hour or ten minutes. So the correct answer here is letter D. I hope you got it. Before we end, you always have to remember to add kindness, subtract judgment, multiply understanding equals Mrs. O's good life equation. Don't forget to click the bell button and subscribe. Thank you.